Hello there ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another video of Gaming Linux. This time around I'm showing you a little game called Unreal Tournament. This is the new version of the game which is uh, pre-alpha. Uh, if you don't know what pre-alpha is, it's very, 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 very early access to the game. Uh, all you want to do is basically go to this website here, which I'll link in the description. And if you're on Linux, uh, you, can, you click on this yes here, yes, to get the Linux client. Nice and easy. Or if you want to run a Linux server, click yes to get the Linux server. But obviously I'll just be showing the Linux client today. Uh, once it's downloaded, you want to open your terminal. I'll show you the step by step. Uh -huh. Open your terminal. And you want to go to CD downloads. Uh, it's uh, extracted, so what will it be? Uh, Linux. Linux, no editor, and then you want to go into your engine, and then after that, your binaries, uh, Linux, and then go ls, and it should bring up all of these things here. So you've got Unreal Engine 4, so these are all my executable things. So I want to run, I've got the command here somewhere, and the command you want to use when, oh, where is it? Yeah, so the command you want to use is this one here. dot dash ue4 space unreal tournament i'll leave that in the description as well for you so when you run that goes through some little finger jobbies uh, as i said it is pre-alpha so you know it's it's so early in uh, into the game's development it's amazing that they are actually allowing us to sort of play the game and sort of maybe help them build the game with them so but yeah, as you can see, it is a full game still. Uh, the the servers are populated by quite a lot of people. Uh, as you can see there, 14 out of 20, so I'll try and join that one there. And here you go. As you can see, see, it is a beautiful looking game, despite the fact that it is pre-alpha. Try and get this down here. Yeah, I got a kill. Uh, Unreal Tournament is one of my favorite games of all time. Um, and I was, I used to be quite good on it actually. Um, so I'm trying not to get too distracted from you. But yeah, like I said, it is a beautiful looking game. Uh, there is a lot of servers uh, that are populated with certain maps. Obviously with each update, which there will be a lot, there will be new maps, uh, new game models, new gun weapon models and stuff like that. Oh. Red team wins the match. There you go, that was a nice couple of lives there, look at that, it's 5-1, so I was actually the third best player, uh, despite only joining literally two minutes ago. But look at them graphics, they, they are stunning graphics. Um, as you can see, you can do stuff here like player settings, so you can actually change your character and stuff like that, uh, to have a beret, I'm, I'm just choosing a beanie for now. Uh, as you can see, you're going to have glasses and stuff like that, and different types of characters and stuff in the future. Um, what's happening? There you go, it's changing. Changing map, finally. Let's see if I can actually kick a bit of ass here. Maybe get myself on the top of the leaderboard. That would be quite a nice little achievement for me there. Press fire when you are ready. Ah, oh, there you go. Oh, it's because I have my pause menu up. But yeah, I've, I'm running a GTX 980 alongside a Intel i7-4790K and I've got it on maximum setting, possible settings and just look at the frame rate, I mean, it's, it's beautiful. Whoa, you see that slide? What the hell? I didn't know you could do that. Oh, nice shot there. God damn, that was nice. Oh, this is this is an old map, isn't it? Yeah, I remember this map. It's just obviously very downgraded in terms of uh, graphical settings. But yeah, they use it seems they're using the uh, old maps as well, so it's pretty cool. That's my teammate. What we're we doing? Okay. Get owned, mate. But yeah, I might actually stream this game in the future and maybe play with some of you guys if any of you would be interested. Uh, definitely hit me up on YouTube. So. Oh! That's my teammate! What are you shooting me for?
Oh, get owned. Oh, yeah, baby. Come on, show yourself. Oh, damn. Get some health, nice. Unreal Tournament has definitely not lost its touch. I love this game so bloody much. Um, it was a shame that they never released Unreal Tournament 3 on Linux. I was really looking forward to that, and it so sucked when they, you know, it took them a while, and then my hopes finally faded after like a couple of years. I, I was looking for a long time uh, for it to be released. I, I still had my hopes up for a long, long time. Um, but I mean, we've we've got Unreal Tournament 4, and now we're getting this game, so uh, that's I'm happy. Cause I'm happy. Oh, little lag spikes there. Not gonna help me. If I die because of lag spikes, I will literally punch my screen. <laughs> oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah. Oh. Where are the enemies? Whoa, ho, we got owned. Whoa. But to be honest, uh, for a game that's in pre alpha. Blue oh. Team wins the match. oh, look at that. No deaths at all. That's a shame, that though. I was trying so long to find enemies. <laughs> Unbeatable. Oh, look at that. Six kills, zero deaths. To be honest, uh, I've not started this my Unreal Tournament gaming life off too badly. What was it, previous round? Five kills, two deaths, so I've got... 11 kills, two deaths in total. So that's not too bad, in my opinion. But, yeah, as I was saying, considering it's in such early access, the game is fully functioning. You can create your own character, there's a lot of servers to join using all some some of the old maps like it was just there but obviously dumbed down a little bit um, and stuff like that and it's so far looking great I'm really happy with it and I highly suggest downloading it as you know you may know it is free to play so you can download it now tag along if you don't like it you don't like it it's free Go away. <laughs> but um, so far, it is looking good. <clears throat> oh, oh, there you go. Oh, this is a nicer looking map, actually, by the looks of it. Got a few more textures on it. Oh, I got killed! Oh my god! <laughs> Such a weird experience getting killed. Ah oh, man! I haven't got any kills here. Please stop, lag spike. Completely unnecessary. <laughs> Where are the enemies? Apparently kicking the team's ass. We're losing currently by a lot. Oh, stop it! Really not helpful when it does that. Thank you so much for that. Oh, stop it! Why is it doing that all of a sudden? Finally, got a kill. That was pretty annoying though, doing little lag spikes. Come on. <laughs> anyway, I think I've shown enough here because everything's just going wrong, so... But yeah, you get the whole gist of it. I'll just return to the main menu and quickly show you guys. As, this, as it says, uh, pre-alpha. Pre it's an early version of the game with a lot of place older content. Unreal Tournament is a collaboration between gamers, developers and Epic Games. There's still a lot to do. 
head over to unrealtournament.com to see how you can make a difference. Um, has the game just stopped working? Uh, there you go. Alright, as you can see here, graphics, everything is on Epic. Uh, decal lifetime full, smooth frame rate, V-Sync, half a V-Sync. And yeah, it's just about looking good. Um, everything's great. And as you play it, you can change them so far to the Necris Mail if you want, which looks strange with a hat. Ooh. Yeah, you get the gist of it. And that's, I think, everything to show today. I think I'm going to uh, release like uh, updates, update videos to this game, so keep you guys in tact with how well it's running and stuff like that, and how well it's how different it's looking, so to say. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Bring and subscribe for future Linux content, and peace out. See you later.